Urban at DIYDanielle.com and today I'm here to talk to you about how to organize your children's bathroom so that it's clean, or easy to clean anyways, and so that it's safe. One thing that I really like about um, our bathroom setup is we kept our original towel rod, which I would have liked to remove it, but it looked like I was going to end up removing some drywall and having to do some repainting. So I ended up keeping that up and I hang some seasonal towels on there and more decorative items. However, right beside it, I added our um, kind of like the coat rack hooks. I show you in an earlier blog post this month about how to make those. So if you're interested, I would go check that out. But you can also just buy one at the store. And these are a little bit easier for the kids to hang things up on. They're easier for me to hang things up on. Um, I just like this a lot better than the um, towel bars, to be honest. And I use them a lot of places in our house. Okay, so on the mirror we have our chore charts, which are also on my blog as a free printable. And my sons are responsible for taking care of the dog or the dogs and they also have some daily chores. We have a dry erase marker that we can keep next to this and we go through at the end of the day and say which ones did you do and they get a bead that goes into their good job jar for the ones they completed and um, the other second jar is just the rest of the beads that we can use. Once they fill that up they can get a special prize or they get a special trip. So we might go to the science center or you know, some other fun place once they fill it up. And I have them fill it up together. These are our wipes, and the nice thing about these is when the kids are, say, brushing their teeth or washing their hands, they can do one of these, and then they can grab a wipe. Whoops, or two wipes. And grab a wipe and wipe up. And they can also, after, or I can, just go around the sink real quick and wipe it up with a wipe. Once I'm done this, I will put it in a wet bag. Usually I hang my wet bag on my hooks alongside my towels. This is our stepping stool. We made this for the blog in September for part of our gift series. It's a really nice idea to have a good stepping stool so your kids can get up and reach the sink and brush their teeth. Now, let's talk about child safety. Right here, we have our, our, um, our cabinets. And my kids um, are pretty good about not going in here without, um, without permission. Mostly because we've had baby proofing on it. And we installed these ones, and these are the ones that you have to push down to get off. But if you're worried about your kid, you can also add knobs, and then also add the, um, the ones that go around the two knobs as well. However, the best option would be to remove anything that's not safe from underneath your um, underneath your sink. So a good thing to store under here would be toilet paper, or paper towels, uh, bubble bath, that sort of thing. You probably still want to baby proof so you don't come home and find, or come upstairs and be like, what were the kids doing? Oh, well they have bubble bath all over the floor. One of the things I'm going to do, and I'm going to show you as part of this series, is we're going to relocate all of our medications. And we do have a little medication box over here. Hold on. I have a medication box along this opposite wall, which I'm not going to show you because it's really hard to get the right angle. But I'm going to take all the medicines and I'm going to take anything that's not safe in here and I'm going to put them in a big basket that goes up high. What we're gonna do is we are going to add a shelf right above here. This is an area my kids cannot reach. In fact, I can't really reach it very well. But it keeps things out of their way. I have my shelf up and I made a little basket to go on top. And that basket has our medical supplies for the children. Once I finished with my shelf, I went ahead and added um, some places to put our toothbrushes and a few safe items inside our cabinet. Now that's all I had and everything is cleaned up. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much. Take care.